The world's longest marathon is 26.2 miles, and only 0.001% of the world's population is able to complete a marathon. But today, I'm going to be trying to double that amount and run 50 miles throughout the 24-hour time period. 50 miles is roughly 100,000 steps. That means I need to average 6,500 steps every single hour, if I, if I want to sleep, that is. Thank you so much for watching. Let's get started. Okay, so I just woke up, but there is one slight problem. I was supposed to wake up at 6 to start my day because I'm trying to get 100,000 in just 24 hours. And I have to sleep, obviously. But I woke up at 8.40, so now I have to make up 2 hours and 40 minutes worth of steps in the exact same time that I have left, so... I guess I'm just gonna have to finish and problem solve. Okay, I just reached 20,000 steps, and so far, so good. I'm trying not to slip on these acorns all over the ground. But I'm about to have to go inside because it should start raining soon. So I'll probably be in there for a few thousand steps. I don't know. Okay, so I did this for about three hours straight, and it finally stopped raining. So I finally get to go outside and walk, which I'm excited about because the wood is hurting my feet. So let's go. It's 49 degrees and it's been raining all day long. It finally just stopped, but the ground is muddy and everything. But I did just hit 50,000 steps, so we're halfway there. And I did the calculations on my calculator because I can't do it all out of my head. I need exactly 6,000 steps every single hour to reach my goal. I started at 1 a.m. last night, but then I went to bed also at 1, and I woke up at 8.30 this morning. So I didn't wake up at the right time, but I'm really confident. So let's get started again. If you're watching this, make sure to subscribe because I've been walking for the past 10 hours and I just reached 60,000 steps, but still, 10 hours without stopping is a lot. So now it's about 48 degrees and in my surprise, no one was actually at this pond. So I gotta walk around the whole thing just to myself. And it's pretty nice because no one was in the way and yeah, I didn't have to look weird in front of anyone. There were lots of, and lots of ducks though. And they kept on flying away whenever I came by. I'm back outside and I have 60,000 steps now, but yeah, it's almost nighttime already and it's 49 degrees, I think. I, oh my gosh. I only have like five hours left. So that only adds up to 90,000, but I'm trying to stay calm. There's exactly a month until Christmas and they already have all the reefs all over the bridge. The sun's already gone. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm trying. I haven't eaten that much today either. I ate breakfast, and then I ate lunch while I was standing up. So I was like running around eating my lunch. And then, it was like Thanksgiving leftovers, I think, or whatever. All the, and I was kind of sad about that. Because I was excited to see all the ducks, and then they just all flew away. Like I said, there's like a hundred of them. Okay, the sun set off for some reason. I'm currently at 80,000 steps, but it's starting to rain again, so I need to go home because uh, I think if it rains and it's cold, it makes you sicker. I don't even know at this point. But yeah, it's starting to rain. I need 20,000 more steps. Okay, so we just got outside and there's a coyote out here. So that makes it uh, more entertaining, I guess. So I was just walking and there was this coyote and it's running. I feel bad for it because people cut down all these trees. But there's just like coyote just running through the grass. So it's like six o'clock now, but the sun just came back out all of a sudden. And I'm kind of confused because, well that's Texas honestly gonna be like 30 degrees and then it can go back to 90 like out of nowhere so the sun just popped back out there's still clouds over there on the other side though 
I'm about to go get my camera so I can start the run again, but we're at 88,000, so let's go. Okay, so I just reached 90,000 steps, and I'm about to go walk somewhere else. It's like, it's still like 6 o'clock, or around 6 o'clock. The coyote ran off into someone's backyard, I think. But, that's okay, I, I guess. This black wasp landed on me, and I went, oh my gosh, I ran so quickly. I get scared really easily, but, so that's on my part. It was that house right over there, so I'm gonna walk past it and see what happens, I guess. I've been walking for like 14, no, like 12 hours now, and it's honestly been a lot. So, it's gonna feel good when I reach the 100,000 steps, so we only have 10,000 more to go. So I'm back at this pond now, and this is the same pond that I filmed the bottle cap video at. The ducks from last time are over there, I think. Yeah, there's two of them. And there's some turtles too. So I only need 10,000 more steps. Oh, there's some ducks over there too. Okay, so I think the coyote is gone now. And it's like 9 p.m., so I need 10, no, not, yeah, it's 9 p.m., so I need like 5,000 more steps, and, yeah, I sped up earlier because I lost some time while I was eating. This dog keeps on barking at me, so I'm not sure there's like another coyote unit trying to warn me or something, but, I don't know, it's probably just trying to be protective. There used to be so many trees over here, but they cut all of them down. This is cool right here because it's like a little pathway all the way down there. Okay, so I'm about to hit 100,000. And I don't want to fall down there. There's like water, I think. Look at the ground, see? It's so jagged. I hear someone screaming and that's kind of scaring me a little. I'm probably gonna go. I don't know, I'm not joking. There's something else out here because like the sun hasn't gone down yet, it came back up. But there's like coyote holes right here and this lady screaming and there's two dogs barking. So I'm gonna leave now. Hopefully go back over there. The pond is beautiful though. I'm at 98,000 and the sun is setting again. So for the second time tonight. So yeah, that's, that's all I'm gonna do today. Just hit 100,000 steps, and now I'm gonna go take a shower. So, thank you all so much for watching.